And now we're going to uh, find out about some of the things you can get up to around the country this week as we join Joe Unwin and the actor Kevin Eldon for the listings. <laughs> OK, thanks, fellas. Hi, and first up this week, Staple Stapleton. A. <laughs> um, this unusual orienteering event takes place in Melksham Woods this Thursday morning. John Stapleton, host of The Time, The Place and Some Other Things, will be released into the wild by trained handlers. After <laughs> giving him 15 minutes to escape, members of the public, armed with office staplers, will set off in pursuit of the thin man and attempt to staple him so hard that the staple is stapled into his skin by the stapler. Now, the staple may be stapled anywhere onto Stapleton by the stapler, but in order to collect your prize, both prongs of the staple must have been stapled into Stapleton's body or face. Now, <laughs> Joe, try to speak. And there's the annual Royal Money Fire on the steps of Buckingham Palace this Tuesday again as usual. Hundreds of millions of thousands of pounds of your money will be thrown into the fire by the Queen, Prince Edward and the Duchess of York, who will then dance around laughing to the accompaniment of a live performance by veteran harmonica player and weakling Larry Adler, a favourite <laughs> of the Duke of Edinburgh. This event, steeped in tradition and history, starts at 1pm and is expected to last for nine minutes. Hey, she ain't nothing but a frog lady. <laughs> and that's all the events for this week. Yeah. Hey, fellas, I was just thinking, it's a shame old Tony Blairs isn't involved in that stapling event, you know, because there's a couple of points I wouldn't mind stapling him down on. What do you mean, sorry? <laughs> well, there's a couple of policies of his I wouldn't mind, uh, you know, nailing him down on. Well, which is it, nail or staple? <laughs> what are you talking about? Yeah, are you saying you, you want to put a staple into Tony Blair? I don't Strange see what you mean. Thing to... I'll leave it for God's sake. <laughs>